Ashley Esqueda, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today, I'm going to show you how to set up a parental control account on your Mac. Now, having a computer that has multiple users can be tricky, especially if those multiple users are your kids. So you definitely want to set up something to where you can monitor their usage and control what they have access to on your computers. Before you get started on setting up parental controls, you want to make sure that you've created a new account that's separate from your own that your kids are going to use and make sure you password protect your own account so that they can't get in and change those settings. If we're looking at our desktop, we are going to go to the Apple and then we're going to go to system preferences and that's all in the top left side of the screen. And once we do that, we're going to get a pop-up and we're looking for a yellow button in the system category, which uh, for me is the fourth category down. And you can see a little adult and an even smaller child that says parental controls and that's what we're looking for. So go ahead and click on that and you'll see parental controls let you manage your children's use of this computer, the applications on it, and the internet. And that's exactly what we want. Now, if it looks grayed out, it's because you actually have to click the lock in the bottom of the screen to make changes to this particular screen. So when you click on it, you have to type in your password for your account, and then it will unlock and allow you to make changes. So you can see I have our kids account here uh, in the upper left of our little pop-up screen. So we're gonna choose that account and you'll see that the screen right next to it has changed and says enable parental controls with a button. So we definitely wanna click on that because you know kids get into all kinds of stuff. We wanna make sure that they're safe and using their computers properly. So once we've clicked on this button, we have a plethora of options to choose from. We can actually do use simple finder, which gives a simplified view of the desktop for really young or inexperienced users. You can limit applications and you don't have to allow app store apps. You can do all kinds of things. You can see in the allowed app section, you can actually uncheck any application that you don't want them to have access to. And you can also check or uncheck if you would like your kids to be able to modify the docs. And the second tab is web. So you have some website restrictions. Uh, and one of the really nice things that Mac does is it gives you this predetermined list of great websites for kids and it will say allow access to only these websites. And you can choose that option and it will only let them go to those particular sites. And you can actually add your own sites to that list by using the plus button right underneath the list itself. There's also a people option and in that tab you can limit mail or iChat. If you don't want anybody contacting your child while they're using the computer, you use this screen. You can actually set time limits, which are great. You can set them on weekday or weekend and you can actually have a bedtime. And there's also other, so you can hide profanity in the dictionary, limit printer administration, limit CD and DVD burning, and you can also disable them from changing their password. So, once we've got all that set up, all you have to do is just click the lock in the bottom left and it will go ahead and lock that setting tight. And now your kids are safe. They are set up to your specifications and you have parental controls on your Mac. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content and we'll see you next time.